Hey ladies and gents, Scheme Rhythm here with another Half-Life 2. This time, I'm not going to be talking like this the entire time, because that seriously kind of started to hurt by the end. I don't mean my, just my throat either. Um, I, I think it was pretty entertaining though, though, looking back, just because of how ridiculous it got. And it did encourage the whole don't stop talking thing too. Uh, let me see. Great, That's, that was my only explosive barrel, wasn't it? Fantastic. Up oh, there we go. So we can get back to actually playing this game decently now, and uh, uh, I say that just as I look over and check the freaking thing for where the next land thing is going to be, and it's not going to be until after I get the submachine gun anyway, which I have a feeling is going to happen in like a few minutes. Oh, look at that. Oh, gee, I wonder what we're supposed to do here. Puzzle solving! Okay. Intelligence! Clearly, it's just as important, right? But anyway... Um... Oh, fuck that! Seriously? Ah, thank goodness for the sprint. Okay. This is before enemies will start popping up in random-ass places. Because they haven't introduced head crabs as a formal enemy yet, just as the cute defanged kind that cannot couple with your head. You know what? Fuck it. I'm talking through this loading screen because I'm really getting tired of them. And it's going to be fun to edit through these. So let me see. This is my third one that I'm recording today. And the fourth one I record today is going to conclude this first week. So if you guys are trying to tell me something, um, well, just know that I'm not going to be able to react to it until the second week of this LP. Which, actually, this is going to be the last one that would go up in this week anyway, because of Metal Gear Solid. But I don't know, because I've, I'm worried about Metal Gear Solid. Not because I necessarily think that I need to, uh... Not because I'm worried that I'm going to want to put it on hiatus, but because something may happen that will force me to put it on hiatus. Which would suck, because I really don't feel like putting an LP on hiatus, considering how early it is into my whole LP. I don't want to say career, because I don't really get paid for this, and... It's kind of the thing about careers is you get paid for them. You're going to be the last one through. Be glad you're not the guy they're looking for. Ugh. Poor bastard doesn't stand a chance. Sounds like they're calling in every CP unit in City 17. So how do I want to cop out? Why? You get By letting NPCs talk whenever I'm not talking. Shit. Too late. I'll protect you, man. Call. Thanks for your help. Look, it isn't safe here. I'll give you some supplies to keep you going, and you really gotta go. Okay, fair enough. So, um, watch yourself once you destroy these, I believe. No, wait, no, that's alright. That part doesn't fall down. One of these parts does, I think. Does it? Oh god, not another brain fart. Because we really need those, right? That doesn't break. Uh, I, gosh, I remember there being some way to get up there. It doesn't involve getting on top of boxes, does it? Gosh, I hope not. That would suck. You know what? It really does not matter, and I should probably stop wasting time. So, you know what? I'm going to just move on. Oh, gosh. This game, this game. I love it, but it's entering one of the dark segments right now. And I don't care for the dark segments too much. Although I guess overall it is a pretty dark game. I mean, especially if, especially once you get to the later areas and you find out what the Combine are really all about doing. But, oh god, this is bad. Um, I'm gonna shoot you. See, this is kind of why I like... Oh, God! Oh, God! That was close. Oh, God. This is why I like to deal with them with the crowbar rather than the pistol, because they do shit like that. Plus, I'm not a very good shot, but that's that's kind of beside the point. <sighs> I have a feeling that because I talked for 15 minutes straight like that, I'm going to have phases where I just slip into talking like this. Whew. 
But, um, yes. I'm just joking, by the way, when I say I'm going for beer. I mean, not that, not that I expect you to judge me for wanting beer or anything, but, um... Oh, God. You know what? Fuck that. Ah. <sighs> So, here is a way you can go. This may or may not be... Oh god, oh god, oh god. Enjoy. I don't think this is a lambda cache, but it is a different... It is a cache full of equipment. So this is not essential to getting the achievements, but it's nice to grab before going on to the next area, which may or may not end up killing you. That's the fun you don't know, especially if you're playing it blind, because, you know. But I'm not playing it blind. I've played this game through several times. Yet I don't know where all the lambda caches are, because I never looked for them. And oh god, stop shooting me. I will hit you in the kneecaps. That's right. Okay, now that we're done with that motherfucker. Um... Let me see here. Just walking along. Do, 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 do. Oh, oh god, the music kicked in. Now it's gotten epic. Give me your weapon. Ah! Submachine gun. Probably the least used gun in the game. Because you never will pro you will probably never use it after this point. And I just noticed that it has a laser sight on it. And Gordon never really uses it. Good job, Gordon. Damn it, I'm slipping into the voice again. Save me! <laughs> Save me! Music's still going. Why is the music still going? Um, is this gonna be our first run, into, run through with a. Is it? Is it? Is it? No. Yes! Zombie! So, yeah, there's a nice look at the. Uh, at a head crab zombie. And you also get grenades. But, more importantly, head crab zombie. Okay, I'm gonna stop grossing you out now. <laughs> oh boy. Oh god, that's right. Sorry, I was looking away. Ah, so towards the exit, there's going to be another cache. And uh. Where is it exactly? I'm not entirely sure. Let me go ahead and get up here. Breathe for a second. Let me think here. I'll probably do some fancy editing. Or I can just sit here and start talking like this again. Because I'm sure you got you didn't get your fill of it last episode. Oh, gosh. Let me see. I don't think it's back in here. I'd like to avoid needless trips if I can, but I can't guarantee anything like that. I don't know if that was even... Was that it that, down there? No, I don't think that was. But anyway, um, this is not it down here, so it's got to be some place that I haven't been to yet. Clearly. And, uh, I really hope I don't make you guys too sick. I'm really jittery when it comes to movement in general, actually. I'm a very fidgety person. I don't know if you, people who might know me in real life, I don't know if you've ever noticed this or not, but sometimes when I'm just standing there, I'll just start fidgeting. I just, I hate the feeling of not moving. It just, it bothers me. Something about not moving is just... Ugh. I can't stand the signs of life not being there. Okay, that's the way to continue. This is a way into nothing. Ah, God! I will shoot... Just for that, I'm going to shoot you. Ah, stupid machine. And of course, Gordon can't jump very high. Gordon's a white boy, after all. Oh, darn it. Oh, God! No. Oh god, it bit, it actually bit me. Bastard, bit me. Oh 
Okay, this is the room that I was talking about with the large pipe and stuff. That makes sense. Oh my god, are you fucking serious? Ah! This is getting on my nerves. Oh god, it's still alive. Well, as alive as a machine can be. But, um... Is that more submachine gun ammo? Okay. No, that was just some stuff for my... Yeah. Alright. <sighs> Ten minutes in. I don't know how much of that's going to end up... You know what? I should just keep moving. Because I need to stop just fishing for things to say. I need more episodes like that last one. Argu I, I know several people are probably going to like, No, you don't! Yes, I do. No, you don't! And... Yeah. Don't need a gun, my ass. Actually, it is rather fun to play through to challenge yourself and not play the game without a, with a gun once you learn how to do that, but um, that is a human skull. Fantastic. Yep, that was a human skull. I think these the steam damages you. Okay, and here's our next Lambda location. Aren't you just enjoying this fancy piece of editing? Not really, it's just something you can't do in Movie Maker, therefore it's fancy to me. That's how it works. You know, that's that's supposed to be how it works, right? Just just something that's not necessarily really fancy, some just fancy to me. I think this is the way to progress actually in that the actual Oh god. Please, for the love of god, you stupid game, let me up. Okay, seriously, this is getting on my nerves. Why? Why? Why seizure time? Ah, oh, God. But anyway, that spot over there with the like supplies and stuff, that's like the actual land location. Ah. And this is just on the other side of where uh, that stuff was. I know you can go back in there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. You know what? I wish I had the alternate ammo on this, because that would, that would be amazing. But no. Gosh. Ah, there he is, in my face. There, point proven. Oh god, I hear man hacks. <laughs> Why am I failing already on this game? I don't. This is a game that's very hard to suck at. I mean, shot. Uh, why do? Why do I suck? I'm being shot at from behind. Damn you, Manhex. I hate Manhex. Oh god, they might actually kill me. I need to be pretty careful here. Being, I'm not used to being so low on health. Oh, please be health. Halla frickin' Luya. So yeah, this first week is going to be entirely 15 minute episodes, and then based on your reaction to those, I guess I'll decide whether I want them to be longer or shorter. And uh, let me see, how much do I really need to... Okay. Not much further now. Sweet. <gasps> oh god, this room. I remember this room. This room is very, very fun. Um, I'm going to stick over here and hopefully not die by doing this. Now, depending on your luck, that may or may not have gotten rid of your man hacks problem. In my case, it did not, but it got rid of most of it, so I can, I'll, I'll accept that. Because most of it is really all you need.
You know, it's honestly better to just time it like this. Because why would you even bother? Why would you even bother trying to kill them normally? Alright. So, there... There's really only one way for you to go to progress. And that is up this ladder. Oh god. Ladder controls. I'm telling you. And then... You get off the ladder miraculously onto this pipe. And then from this pipe, you can either go to... Well, I don't know why you would go there, but... You can try to make a jump here, which I don't think works. Or you can walk over here. And I don't know if you have to crouch or not. No, you didn't. Well, I crouched anyway. And voila. I don't know why I'm talking about this game as if it's a guide or something. Like, you really need to know how to get through the basic progression. It's pretty linear. I mean, it's not hard to figure out. But, you know, I, I should probably not have that much faith in humanity. After all, I exist. <sighs> so, that's all you're going to do here, is you're going to raise the water level. And, um... Let's see, if I remember correctly, you have to go out and around to get into this room down here. Yep, you have to go around. So you're going to have to get, make your way to the ladder. Where's the ladder? Where's the ladder? There's the ladder. Why did the ladder not work? There's something wrong here. There's something I just can't quite put my finger on that I should be getting into. Oh well, I better get out of here before my oxygen runs out. I'm pretty sure I didn't miss a land to cash there. Because just because of the way it looks, it doesn't look according to this thing that I am looking at and shit. Shit. Ah. You know what? Let's see you bastards follow me underground underwater. Oh god, they tried it. I better get out of here before they figure out how to get to me. Alright. So we're here now. Whew. So, this puzzle, very simple. Dive down, break the boards, without breaking the boxes, preferably. And then once you see your oxygen running low, just break for the surface, seriously. Do not stay underwater for too long, because you do not want to run out of health by drowning. It's like the least glorious way to die. Just ask Mario. Alright. Come on, you. Come on, you. Come on, you. There we go. You really only need to get the two round the round things free. And oh god, I'm running out of water. Oxygen. Ugh. Oh god. It's like drowning in Team Fortress 2. The one way you really would not want to die. I've seen it happen to people, though. I don't know if it was intentional or not, but that's that's kind of not the point. Alright, there's nothing at all down here, so I'm going to get back to the surface now. Oh god, sweet air! <sighs> Hearing me make goofy noises is probably half the fun of this, isn't it? And voila! There we have a bridge! made of wood okay guys so we made some significant progress here so I'll see you guys in the next Half-Life 2 and yeah I know it was pretty abrupt but I uh, will see you bye bye